first of all it was, it was like an abstract and then it was personal. Feeling my depth and then feeling the world. Things collectively, whereas this, there's this really incredible sense. It's interesting because yours presence. is so electric, and mine's actually the opposite of that electric, it's the flow. Mm. Yeah. Just, and I feel like mine's a lot of internal, whereas yours seems a lot of external. Oh, it's external. all external, isn't it? Except for that. My, 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 um, my life force, the, the, the life that's actually within me, is not always within my control, and um, there are circumstances that are outside my control and uh, places that come into me, that are into my life that are outside my control and to, uh, and yours is. to know that there is someone who can And that's just the that. flow between yeah. the external yeah. and the internal and you don't yeah. exist yeah. externally yeah. at all, Ruth. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. It no, but I'm because what really interested me was if I had a thought that was self-critical, then the dots went red. Then if I said something that I accept myself, it all went blue. I thought, wow, how quick is that, you know? Just knowing that I'm capable of big things. <laughs> knowing I'm capable of, of, of doing, and at the moment I'm dealing with a life-threatening illness, so that's important for me, yep. that I'm actually capable of stepping into another realm as well yeah. and changing things. Yeah. So maybe that's why the halo and all that. <laughs> That's it. Thanks so much. You're very welcome. Thank you.